Hi guys, I'm Arpit, your growth and AI for marketing trainer. I'm really excited for today's video because what I'll show you today will be really, really valuable for you guys. I wish I'd found this tool earlier. I was looking for such a solution for a long time to sell my own courses. This tool blew my mind because it offers so much value. It can actually help us save hundreds of dollars and a lot of time. So the tool is called system.io, system with an E in the end since it's a French company. In a nutshell, it's a free ClickFunnels alternative. In fact, it replaces a bunch of other tools required to run a digital business. So system.io combines six different marketing tools into a single marketing platform. I'll give you a demo of the tool, but before that, let's understand how this is helpful for you. So what are the core tools we need to run and scale a digital business? Well, to begin with, we need a website builder so we can actually create a website and attract some prospects. Then to turn these prospects into paid customers, we need sales funnels. We also need an email marketing solution that can help us nurture these leads, upsell and cross-sell. We also need a paid member area so that we can offer our products securely. These could be courses, live training, live videos, uh, consultancy, ebooks, or any sort of digital products. Then we also need a marketing automation solution that can help us create a robust system uh, so we can scale our business. And then finally, we also need an affiliate program management tools so that we can create an army of affiliates that can sell for us. As of now, you might be using a different tool for performing each of these functions. How inefficient is that? You might be paying hundreds of dollars for performing just one of this function and juggling between tools. Now, what if I tell you, you can do all of this for free? Isn't that amazing? If you check out the pricing plans for system.io, you will be pleasantly surprised. You get 1000 contacts in the free tier plan, which is a good number to start with. The free plan has these amazing features like sending unlimited emails, three sales funnels, blogs, membership sites, automation rules, workflows, email campaigns, order bumps, Stripe and PayPal integration, your own affiliate program, only two important features are not included, custom domains and automated webinars. The next plan which is for $27 includes custom domains so you can start with as little as $27. I pay $100 to Teachable for just hosting my courses, plus I pay for email marketing and CRM separately. So with system.io, we can start with just $27 and their max plan is for $100. If you compare it with ClickFunnels, so the minimum ClickFunnels plan is for $97. I believe system.io has the most comprehensive features at this price point in the market. I'm actually thinking to launch my upcoming courses on their platform. They also have a Zapier integration, so you can connect it with other tools very easily. Okay, so now that you have a good idea about how this tool is helpful, let me give you a quick demo and make it easy for you. So sign up using the affiliate link in the description. If you do so, I'll give you access to my paid courses. Plus you also get a chance to support my channel so I can continue making such videos. If you sign up using my affiliate link, send me an email at arpit at nstmindia.com. I'll verify it and then release the access for my paid courses. So once you sign up and you're in the dashboard, you can see the number of leads and sales in the last 30 days. That's nice. I like the dashboard. It's not crowded, but maybe they could add a couple more widgets here. Like they can show the traffic here or the sales funnel conversion rate. Then we have contacts. So like I told you earlier in the free plan, you can have thousand contacts. Anybody who fills up a sales funnel form that you created using system.io will show up here. I'll show that to you in a bit. You can also import your contacts if you already have a list. Then we have funnels. Let me quickly show you how to create a funnel. Click on create. You'll see different kind of funnels you can create. I'll select sell as I'll create a funnel for selling one of my courses just for the tutorial purpose. So let's name the funnel as AI for marketing course funnel. Choose the currency in which you want to sell and then click on create. On the left here, you can see the steps in the funnel. This is the order of the pages in your funnel. You can change the order of the steps just by dragging and dropping it. Since I selected the sales funnel option, I see an order page and a thank you page. To add a new step in the funnel, click on create step. 
from the type drop down you will see different kinds of pages you can create like we see here squeeze pages pop up forms sales page order page upsell downsell webinar etc i'll select the pop up form type just to show you hit save now on the right you will see a bunch of templates the templates change as per the step type you selected like we see a bunch of templates for the pop up form i'll delete this step for now let me show you the page builder and how easy it is to design your page so i'll select a template now you can edit the step name you can also decide the page url you can see right now the page is hosted on system.io subdomain because i am on the free plan if you're on the startup paid plan you can add your own domain name here you will see the option of adding a custom domain under profile settings and then custom domains click on add domain to add your domain you will have to add a c name record in your dns for now we'll head back to editing the order page then you can decide the affiliate commission for this product and pay out delays in terms of the number of days then you'll also see the option to add resources this is what the customer will get after buying this product it can be a course course bundle a tag or even a physical product if i select the course option then it'll ask you to select the course you want to give access to since i haven't created any course yet i don't see anything here to create a course you need to select the course option under the product sales option in the top navigation bar click on add a new course give your course a name and description under name i'll put ai for marketing course then you can decide the url path color big image small image and hit save now you could add students and modules for this course i'll click on add module and name the module as ai for marketing introduction hit save then click on add lecture let's name the lecture as machine learning fundamentals if you want to drip the course lecture you can add the number of days to delay this lecture then i'll select the page type as a video hit save this template looks good you can add your unlisted youtube video link here then also add the text for this lecture and additional resources if applicable then click on save changes Now if I go back to the funnel that we were creating and I add resources and select the membership course I can see the name of the course we just created you can also choose the course access type as full access or drip content then you can also create price plans for that we need to add our payment gateway it's simple to do under profile settings you will see the option of payment gateways then you could integrate your stripe or paypal payment gateway like i'll click on connect with stripe now all i need to do is log in into my stripe account for now let's go back to creating our funnel you can also add coupons but first you need to create one from the coupon options under product and sales in the top menu now to edit this template go to the step configuration tab and on the right you will see an edit page option Here you get a pretty straightforward what you see is what you get page builder like if i click on the logo here i can upload my own logo i can edit the text to say ai for marketing course you can add all these elements that you see on the left blocks are also pretty cool they have some common blocks that a website may have opt in forms features footers themes welcome etc I like the block under the opt-in form and would like to add it so I can just pick it up and drop it where I want it to be. You can also delete any section you want. Now let's say you wanted to add another field in the form. So what you could do is either use the form input element, but it actually has a different style. You could customize the settings to make it look like the other field, but I'll actually delete it and just clone an existing field. Now when I do that you can see the spacing is gone from the top so what I can do is get into its settings and increase the margin from the top yep now it looks good I can also decide a form field input type let's select the city and I'll remove the placeholder text it is missing from the field heading so I can clone an existing one then move it a row down and adjust the margin to make it look consistent let's change the text to city 
Similarly, you can edit the entire page and make it look like how you want it. Then you can preview it and see how it looks on the phone by pressing the mobile icon. Just click on save changes and hit exit. So this is how you can create funnels for your business. Wasn't this fun? Now let's talk about email marketing. So under the emails tab, you will see three options, newsletter, campaigns and statistics. Let's look at them one by one. Newsletter is a single email that you could send to your contacts. Click on create a newsletter. Create your subject line. I'll just put here top digital marketing updates June 2021. Put your brand name under sender name like I'll put NSTM India. Now the sender email cannot be Gmail so use your custom domain name like I'll put here arpit at nstmindia.com. Then I'll use the visual editor and click on create. Now we can create the email template using the visual editor. They have all the basic information here. You could also use merge tags to personalize emails. When done, click on save changes and then hit exit. Now you could add an attachment if applicable. You could also decide to send emails to only contacts who registered X days ago. You can also include or exclude contacts using tags. Then you could either send the email now or schedule it for later. Now let's talk about campaigns. Through campaigns, you can send multiple emails in a sequence you decide. Under the campaigns tab, click on create. Let's name the campaign as AI course nurture and hit save. Then click on campaign name. Now here you can add multiple emails and decide their sequence. Click on add an email. For me, the sender name will be NSTM India. Use a custom email, give it a subject. Like I'll put in application of AI in marketing. Choose visual editor and hit create. Then create the email using the editor. Hit save and exit. Now when you click on save and publish, it will ask you delay before sending the email in terms of hours or days. So when a user fills up a form on your website through automation, you can subscribe the user to this campaign and specify when he should receive his first email after filling up the form. You can also specify this email should be sent after which email. I don't see anything here since this is the first email in this campaign. Then you can also decide the time and the day of the week this email should be sent. Hit publish. Similarly, you can create a number of emails that you would want to send in a sequence as a part of this campaign. Then finally, we have the statistics tab here where you can see some general email stats like number of emails sent, open and bounced, etc. Campaign specific stats can be seen in the campaigns tab. Okay, now let's talk about automations. So you'll see rules and workflows under the automation tab. Click on add a rule. Then you can specify a trigger and an action. Click on add trigger to see all the triggers available like tag added or removed, funnel or blog page form subscribed, campaign completed, registered for a webinar, enrolled in a course, new sale, link clicked, page visited. So I'll select the funnel step form subscribed, then choose funnel we created earlier and the step page. Then click on add an action. Now you can see all the actions available. So I'll select subscribe to a campaign and select the AI course nurture campaign that we created earlier. Hit save. Now let's talk about workflows. The difference between rules and workflows is that in workflows you can define a trigger and then automate multiple steps based on that trigger. Click on create. Let's give the workflow an appropriate name. Then click on workflow name. Create your first trigger, then we'll see the same trigger option as we saw under rules. I'll select the new sale option and then the order form through which the sale happened. Click on the add icon below your trigger. Then you'll see three options, action, decision and delay. We have already seen the action earlier. Decision can be used to create a yes, no split. So let's create a filter based on tags. Now I can see contacts tagged with and I'll select the AI course converters tag and hit create. Now I can see a yes and no split and add a specific step for yes and a specific step for no. 
Delay is pretty straightforward. You can delay the automation by minutes, hours, or days. I hope this gives you a strong idea about how to use workflows. Now let's talk about our final tool within this tool, how to set up your own affiliate program. So know that in system.io, we have a built-in affiliate program. That means your affiliates don't have to explicitly sign up as an affiliate. If they fill up any opt-in form and become a part of your contact list, they automatically become an affiliate. All you need to do is send them an email with their affiliate ID. So when you are in the visual editor using the merge tags, you can send them their affiliate ID and the affiliate dashboard link. So your affiliates get the system.io dashboard. Obviously it doesn't have the other options. They can just see their progress as an affiliate. All they need to do is send traffic on your website with their affiliate ID in the end. I'm adding a video link in the blog for this video. You can access it from the description to know more about affiliate programs. That'll be all for this video. Now it's your turn to test the platform. Go create a free account with system.io right away and launch your online business. If you find this video valuable, make sure you hit that like button. Share this video with anybody you think it'll be useful for. Subscribe to the channel for more such content. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next one.